Right. Got to Porlock Weir, had an ice cream, went to the ladies, topped up water, got plenty of water now, and apparently it's one and a half miles to the church. Of course I came here the other day and uh, walked all around that. Let's just hope it's well signposted. One and a half miles doesn't sound far, does it? I'll just zoom in over there a minute. The ship just came in. A yacht, I mean. Looks nice. It's better deciding whether to get off or not. Can't quite make out with my eyes at the moment what that says. Always reminds me of my yachting days, my sailing days, the Ocean Youth Club. Right, so we've come up through this little trap behind the pub, the anchor. And we're going through a gate. My intent, I'm not doing the whole loop. Because I've still got to walk back to, um, I'm just going to go to the church and back. That's hard to shut. So here we go, got this hill. They've all got names, all these hills, by the way. I, re I really wanted to have something to eat, really. I was starving. There's everyone eating, you know. There's people eating all the time. I think sometimes they only visit to eat. <sighs> this is for me though. My own personal reflections. Another way down there, look. Coastal path, and we just, it says to the church this way. Let's just hope it's right, shall we? It's a nice afternoon. We'll worry about how we get back, even if I have to get a taxi. I don't really care. And I've seen something big up there. Some sort of bird moving. Is it a pheasant? What on earth is that? Yeah, it is a pheasant. Quite a large one. I haven't had pheasant for years. There's a big hill. They've all got names, these hills. Right, I'm going to turn off in case it goes off. Turn off for a minute. Now, it could be some people have done the church this morning and stop off for lunch on the way back, you see. It's one and a half miles. Now, I've done what said three quarters of a mile. And that was quite strenuous. Uh, this is supposed to be strenuous. I mean, at the moment, I'm feeling all right, but... <sighs> I just really want to get to the church and back. That will be enough for me today. And, of course, I, gotta, I know I've got to get back to the campsite. I'm going to worry about that later. <sighs> I mean, a mile can take you three hours if it's really strenuous, can't it? It'd be nice to see some of these people out walking now, wouldn't it? They've probably done it when they were younger. I don't know, a lot of people my age, aren't they? I did recognise a couple of people having a lovely meal with a pint of lager. Yeah, I did see that. And uh, there we go. This is my last day today as well. It's been a real strenuous hiking holiday though for me. I've been up and down these beacons here. I've been up and down them. Bosnington Carn, Bosnington Beacon. 
I, and, and walk from mine head and everything. Right, someone's coming. Just turn off a minute. Right, I've just met some three walkers who are raising money for charity uh, to end cervical cancer. I just mentioned that I heard that boys were going to get the jab as well, and they were surprised I knew. I said, yeah, I, you know, I've just heard about that. And they're called 3,500 to end it. And so that's the number of miles they've got to do, apparently. Well, that's what they're trying to achieve. And they've still got six... No, they've still got quite a long way, 1,600 or something to go. Um, so they must be doing the coastal walk, I should imagine. So, um, yeah, they're three really friendly people. Now, which way do we go here, folks? What do you reckon? What do you reckon, folks? That way or that way is a horseshoe? Time to turn off. Hold on. Right, this is the um, toll road. You have to pay to use it, apparently, at your own risk. Not as like it well, I haven't been here before. I've just met a lady who I, she didn't realise, but I did see her the other day on um, Beacon Hill. Um, she, I think she'd done the rough route. She's, well, she's going to be 40 years younger than me, isn't she? Uh, yeah, if, if, uh, I don't know what country she's from, but uh, she's got all the proper gear on. Oh, both sticks. Yeah, everyone's told me there will be a section of um, strenuous climb with steps. Then it flattens off. So, I think I can probably cope with that, and I'll be coming back down, that's what you think of. And it's like she said, you've got the views. So I'm doing a small video, and I shall be stopping the video. I'll be doing photos, but as this starts to get steep, I won't be having it on. Okay? But there's some lovely views. I'm just going to take my time. These people have been telling me it takes about half an hour. So. But then they're going at their pace, see? Eh? Young and fit. <sighs> Look at that. This isn't even the start yet. Over note. See you when I'm at the top.